Hey there gamers, this is it, this is the list you thought I'd never do. I'm back to bring you the top 10 greatest video games of all time. Only 10 games can make it onto here, so if your favorite game didn't get on, well, tough fucking shit. Personal bias has no room here, so get ready for the mother of all video game lists as we take through the journey of greatest games of all time. Number 10, Toilet Kids. This classic smop answers the age-old question. What if you could go inside your toilet? For Toilet Kids for the PCFX, you got forces of shit and shit and shit. I mean, there's shit everywhere. There's shit everywhere. There's shit everywhere. There is shit everywhere. Number nine, Katara Sojo. First of all, memes. Well, now that's out of the way. Number eight, Pac-Man. Two, the new adventures. Pac-Man 2 was quite ahead of its time at its release as it introduced the first mentally handicapped video game character. As you can see, Pac-Man seems to suffer from some sort of brain damage, so you need to guide him through his daily task of the day. It's pretty... exciting? Why do they make this? No, uh, seriously, why? Why? Who is asking for this? What the fuck? Number 8, Initial D. In this game, you step on the gas. And once you step on the gas, you can drift. See, this game is all about stepping on the gas. Come here, number six. Call it you want. Call it you two. Call it you three. Call it you four. Come in flat. Put it in two. Do it in two. Do it in two. Do it in two. No okay shooters. Number five, Mr. Bones. After starring in many games with no credit whatsoever, Mr. Bones finally gets his own starring role in this game for the Sega Neptune. With hyper-realistic graphics and innovative gameplay, Mr. Bones will challenge the game to scale with over 200 levels of non-stop bone action. With a story that makes you think, Mr. Bones is probably the Citizen Kane of gaming, and maybe and it is probably the greatest game of all time that has ever been created. Which is why it's number 5 on this list. Number 4 is Bubsy. Wait, Bubsy? I'm kinda... kinda getting some kinda... Deja vu! I've just been in this place before Higher on the street and I know it's my time to go Calling you and the search Number 3 is... Uh, sh Whoa, I don't have anything for number 3. Oh shit. Shit, oh shit, I need a game for number three. <laughs> no. Hell no. 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 Sure, this would do. The two, Bomb N69 from the Nintendo 72. A new take on the Bomberman series, where in this game everything is made out of blocks and circles instead of lines like those old ass games. Bomberman 555 has an engaging plotline where you versus forces of evil with such memorable characters such as Give it up! And who could forget? You wanna fight me? This Russian classic is still played by hundreds today with its engaging multiplayer with online play. And if anybody says this multiplayer sucks, they are wrong. Bomb and Dirty FPS is a true timeless classic. Before we get to the most iconic spot of all, let's get through some honorable mentions. Spider Wars! It's gonna kill me. Oh yeah, you're about to get owned. Let me explain to you why Excite Bike is the greatest video game of all time. Excite Bike. What the fuck is that? Is that a bug? Oh shit, it's on me! Get it off of me! Get it off of me! Get it off! Get it off! Get it off! Oh my god! Get the fuck off! 